Oke, okay. halo. <laughs> good evening everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Yeah, good evening. Yeah. Good day, sir. How many days? That means uh, another few days will be our Chinese New Year. <laughs> Time is really fast, huh? So, so how how is our preparation? Is are we are we are we ready in a way? Uh? are we ready internally or externally? <laughs> I mean, is our heart prepared for the new year or whatever it is? Uh? And things yeah. of course, preparation for new year is buying things, uh, but it's our heart, ourself, uh, Are we ready, uh, to, to 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 receive? Uh? I mean. To, Not welcoming the new year. I mean, our Chinese New Year. This sort of thing. Uh. <laughs> I am ready. I am ready. Chai Sen Tam. Chai Sen Tam. Hi, sir. Red Red Ting also ready for. Hello, good evening. Whoever said come in, ah, uh, come say hello. To Auntie Bole, yeah, nice to see all of you here. Yeah, so tonight our topic uh, is uh, this evening our topic is forgiveness. Hmm, forgiveness. Uh, for me, it's a very every time when we discuss about things, uh, I always feel that it's a uh, yeah. Hello, Lisa. Good evening, Lisa. Yeah, hello, ladies. Yeah. So, Lisa, tonight this evening, uh, we are talking about forgiveness. What is forgiveness? I, I go through this. Uh, what do you call that? The Google lah. Uh, it, it means uh, choosing to let go of anger and resentment towards yourself or someone else. I mean, to ourselves also, right? Ah, uh, to surrender thoughts of revenge and to move forward, things like that. Uh, so, uh, as we uh, see my poster there, we read out: Have you ever blamed or been angry with someone for what they have done to you? Are you able to forgive and forget? Uh, This kind of thing, forgiveness. So let let's see your definition of forgiveness to to you lah. Like you personally view how what do you think about that? Uh, Lijin, Lijin, yeah. Uh, forgiveness. Uh, as a child, <laughs> I like to bring back to during childhood time. Uh. <laughs> childhood time, we have lots of time among friends. We say. I don't forgive you. I don't forgive you. But then two days later, we forgotten already. <laughs> then we become friends again. So those days, ah, uh, the words that we use, we use it so often and uh, without much meaning. It's just that at that moment when we when we feel that somebody has um uh, not been too nice to us, or maybe have done something we thought they have done wrong to us. The first word uh, or some of the words that come out is that I won't forgive you. You wait and see how. <laughs> I remember primary time. And then we can write uh, on pieces of paper and uh, usually they are my neighbors. Nah. Uh, so we'll throw papers to them and say, I won't forgive you. I don't like you. You know, all those words. Uh. Uh, And then after two days later, we 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 are playing five stone together again. Yeah. So at that time, maybe the word uh, "I won't forgive you," "I don't like you" is being used quite loosely, lah. Huh? Uh, <laughs> but as we grow older, uh, when these words come out, it's like so sharp to us, you know. We know somebody won't forgive us, and then we also don't forgive people. The words become stronger, lah. The words become stronger, and. And uh, not to be simply used like in childhood time, lah. This is uh, what I gather from my growing up stages, lah. <laughs> okay, Esther. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I mean, uh, that time when playing with friends, ah, uh, uh, friends will come and hold my hand and say, "We run, 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 run away from that, from from another friend," because uh, I say, uh, be before I ask why, uh, the friend already said we we don't want to be friends with them already. We quickly run, run, run. Then she hold my hand and run, run, run. Say, don't friend them, ah, don't friend them. I said, don't know what, ah. So I mean, we all friend, ah, just go like this. But before I, before I have a thought on what happened, ah, they already, we already all friend to give friend again. <laughs> we are back to friend again. So, so ah, uh, from ah, uh, forgive, forget, ah. I find that, ah, in a child is much more clear, lor. They just say only after that, ah, they don't mind. They didn't bring to heart, lah. So I find that uh, childhood time I'm very happy because 
don't have so much issue lah. Don't have issue like huh? if uh, linger for a long time or not. No, the the length, the span of time is very short lah. For especially for negative one, very short. A while lah, gone already. Always happy only. You know how to play only. <laughs> More of <laughs> playing <laughs> can play can already. If not, after a few days, no friend to play, huh? then then suffering. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that that's very true, you know, Esther and Jim. That that made me recall during my childhood. I have a neighbor who always play with me. Every afternoon when we come back from school, that we will shout at each other, see whoever is ready first. Come on, wow. Come, come and play. Also, we go. So, so we always have this really, really now. I recall back. I'm going to friend you. Wow. That's like that. Go back. Tomorrow morning, hey, afternoon, still call our name. Hey, sorry, like, I, I'll friend you again. You know, this kind of thing is not even uh, uh, le less than 12 hours, you know, sometimes, you know. Or in the evening, they'll call. I, I want to friend you again, you know. It's so easy. And then we, we, we immediately, we, we, we just take consult our friend again. We never thought of anything. But now as we go older at this stage, we don't even say, I don't friend you. Just by a simple word or a simple gesture that by our action, people will think that I don't want to friend you. So <laughs> that means deep. Just by certain thing you say or certain action or whatever thing, people think you don't want to friend them. So, <laughs> so what do you mean? Uh, forgiveness, uh, these words, they are so dif mean so different things to different people, right or not? So, I mean, why is it nowadays uh, we, we find it so hard to say when we grow older? Nah? Some people say, like, like, like when we were younger, people say, all right, I friend you, like, I want to friend you. But nowadays as we grow older, why is it so hard that we, to say, to, to ask for forgiveness or to say sorry to someone? What, what do you think? Um, yeah. Okay, I said, uh, friend don't friend and forgive don't forgive. They are two different words, lah. Huh? Uh, because mm. uh, now we are into the topic of you know, forgiveness. Uh, mm. Sometimes I also wonder why people, um, you know, I don't know what I've done wrong, lah. That they they like won't forgive me. I have a feeling that they don't forgive me because they cut me off from Facebook. They cut me off from all the phone, all the contact. I have a uh, two person in my lah throughout my whole life, ah. Uh, uh, they totally cut me off from Facebook, and I do not know where I've gone wrong. I just hope that uh these two person can come up to me because I try to contact them and not possible for me to contact because there's no way they totally cut off. They can come and approach me and and uh, let me know la, where I've gone wrong. But anyway, uh, I I don't think I have anything to forgive them because uh, it's nothing, you see. But also can uh, I also can forgive them. But I do not know for what also, is it? Uh, so this type of feelings, uh, sometimes uh, we we really don't know, no. We are we are we are in the dark, uh. So, ladies and gentlemen, I hope that if uh, you are angry with somebody, let that somebody know. <laughs> let that somebody know why why you are angry with that person. If not, that person uh, can be said don't care, or like me, I am still puzzling and I feel a bit sad, lah. I feel sad that you know I do not know what is the reason behind that they uh block <laughs> Facebook and then block even WhatsApp and and things like that. You know, uh, if I've done wrong, uh, please forgive me. <laughs> please forgive me. And uh, and uh, yeah, lah. Maybe I don't need to find out the reason why, lah. I just be at my own ease of mind, um, uh, just to forgive and forget. Uh, forget is not easy because uh, this uh, friends uh, uh, before that we are close and now it's just that we lost touch uh, and I just hope that whoever have lost touch with me and who have thought that I have done wrong to them let me know <laughs> uh, yeah so um, as we grow older we are wiser hopefully and we forgive whatever it is if there is to be for uh, to forgive or there's something to forgive just forgive lah. just forgive <laughs> and have a peace of mind yeah <laughs> to you esther <laughs> oh, okay forgive forgive i mean 
Uh, yeah, in this way, I also have to ask for forgiveness. But the thing is that, nah, uh, I if I didn't tell me straight, I also don't know. Also, I I won't I won't be known. So normally, I tell people that nah, you need to be direct to me. Otherwise, nah, I don't know what. Nah. <laughs> I never know. <laughs> if anything, uh, you, you want to let me know, you have to be just straightforward and let me know. You have to be very frank. Like, otherwise, uh, I really don't know. If even yeah. you tell me a long story, sometimes I also don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they, want to, they want to label me as blur queen or anything. Also, never mind. But the thing is that I have to be honest. I just say, uh, you, I really need you to be frank otherwise i really don't understand <laughs> yeah yeah that's true that's true yeah. and then regarding facebook there uh, we uh, delete someone or stop friend or whatnot uh, i've ever stopped this and that but i don't know i uh, after that i also don't know and then someone they come and tell me that uh, they already um not friend me with that already because uh, she got too many uh, this and that. But now she said, I want to be friend with you. I also don't know. And then I just, <laughs> so I also, never mind uh, because uh, I don't mind because who, who out and who in, uh, I also don't know. <laughs> huh? I don't know. I choose to not know, know or what now, uh, or maybe I didn't pay attention uh, or I don't, I really don't mind this thing uh, because I know a uh, thing will be going wrong. Uh. Either they will come and go, come and go. Uh, it doesn't matter. The important yeah. thing is every uh, every moment, uh, my behavior. I try to uh, self check uh, whether I I harm anyone or not. Uh. Mm. Uh, indirectly, uh, indirectly got hurt anyone or harm anyone. That will be too sorry. <laughs> and then if the if the one that didn't let me know, I also still don't know. That will be very sorry case. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Esther. Yeah, because tonight we talk about forgiveness. Uh. That's why we say sometimes because everybody, what, what do you call that? Everybody have their own uh, point of view on everything. So we might not be the same. Whatever thing that we say we feel is okay, but that person may not think it's okay. So that's why this kind of thing becoming, uh, uh, they, they're holding something from, from us. Like, okay, may, may, maybe they broke us from Facebook because they, they, feel they, they don't like the way you talk to us. Or talk to me or something like that. That's why they block you. But as what you say, we, we never say out. We, we don't know what's wrong. And then we, as Jean also say, why why she block me? But I hope we can be uh things is okay. So that means this kind of thing. That's why if you don't tell me, I don't tell you. So can we have that kind of thoughts in uh, in myself? Sometimes I say, let her have the choice. What do you think sometimes? Because we. We have not done a mistake which is so big. For us, we feel that it might not be that big that you, you, you just don't forgive me or, or we don't forgive people. What, what do you think about this kind of thing? Like, uh, what kind of thing we feel is big thing or small thing that we really need to seek for forgiveness? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, Auntie Bole. Eh? Mm, yeah, uh, again, uh, like uh, you said, big or small. Eh? Uh, sometimes it's uh, depend on individual, right? If we have the contact, uh, we still can contact that person. But when if it's a total block, uh, like out of our life, uh, we, there's no way we can seek that person out for clarification. I remember one uh, in incident um, during uh, my business days, uh, you know, business, we uh, do uh have a lot of decision making that may have offended people or we thought we are doing the right thing but others may not think so so there was this uh, couple that uh, really uh, broke off just like that you know and uh, but i have their contact they they don't block me from facebook they don't block me from uh, whatsapp they don't block my number or what uh so uh, there was one christmas day uh, christmas day uh, a few years, uh, many years back, lah. Then I decided, I uh, Christmas Day, uh, I want to do something different and uh, to uh, clear certain doubts in my life, lah. So I took their number and I called them, lah. I called them, 
and I apologize first. Like I said, uh, very sorry for whatever I've done. Uh, whether uh, no, I don't even try to justify whether God or don't have. I just say I'm sorry what I've done. Uh. And till today, we are best of friends. So whenever I, I'm, I'm, I'm at their hometown, wow, they will bring me out for big makan and all. Just because of that gesture, uh, that Christmas day, uh, that I felt that I need to do something. And I have their contact. So I just call them and just say sorry for whatever I have done, whatever it is. I don't need to explain anything, just say sorry. And it clear the doubt. Now. And I'm very, very happy of that decision. And I also hope that others, which I may, they may be misunderstanding, I can have their contact and I can clear lah. Huh? before I leave this world. Uh. <laughs> I want to clear. And uh, like Auntie Bole, all this uh, is due to misunderstanding and uh, miscommunication. So communication in our life is so important. And clarity again, uh, because misunderstanding happened due to no clarity is it? Or, or not enough clarity. So I hope that uh, uh, we can have more clarity in life and also communication and pick up the phone if you feel that that's the thing you need to do just do it lah huh? <laughs> that's my little story to you esther <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah uh, i find that uh, issues that need to say forgive or not to forgive uh, one thing is see whether we clearly understand the situation or not lah. are we clear or not the understanding clear understand do we have clear understanding on that topic lah? Then if we see whether it is big or small, uh, I will define in this way. Uh, if I keep on thinking, keep on thinking, uh, then I keep on thinking and then into it, uh, then uh, that means it's big. Uh. If uh, for me, I uh, just can laugh away, uh, that is okay. Uh. <laughs> so if keep on thinking, uh, I will find a way out already. I will find a way, uh, I will see how to contact that person and make it clear. Because if I keep on thinking, sometimes I will ask a friend, I say sorry because I, I have thought, I, will get, I, I mean, I have thinking a few times, so I have to ask you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in, in this way, I, I will say sorry first because sorry why I must ask you is because I keep on thinking. That's why I have to ask you. If uh, that is, I consider big. No? If no, then it's okay. Then uh, if we have clear understanding, normally uh, it's okay. When we have clear understanding, uh, uh, the thing will be clear. Lah. Then there is nothing to say forgive or not. Mm. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Now, now we have our friends here. We have Seng Hua. Yeah, we have Seng Hua. We have Chloe here. And then there's a Ben. Ben uh, Hepsiba. Is it something like that is from Australia and his wife. Yeah. Talking about this clear communication and what, what uh, this uh, Jin was saying. If, if we can... To, to sort of to call them and, and tell them what's in your mind is in our thought. Uh, uh, but to, to me, sometimes, I, yeah, it, it's good that I, I like to like clear the air or like, something like that, even though sometimes we don't talk to neighbor due to some uh, misunderstanding as well, you say. So uh, for me, it's, uh, I, I don't mind to take the first step or the approach to just talk to them and just, uh, what do you call, uh, to clear whatever things that inside their mind, maybe they are not happy with or whatever. So when we start talking to them and the you know when you start talking they they, they also feel that i so much so just talk maybe at that moment they are angry they, they don't want to talk to me anymore yeah because they, we are in our our residential area because we, we do a lot of things so sometimes they, they don't like the thing that we do so when i talk to them i don't want to talk to you but something like that they are angry lah, but we, we let them cool down and then after some time we talk to them about some other thing which they never related one well, not, not so talk about how is your house, how is your pain. So they, they sort of start talking back to you. So I feel that this way we, we don't really go direct to that issue. So when you start talking, so next day we ask, uh, uh, have you taken your meal and everything just back to normal. Uh, this is what I feel. Uh, because sometimes to, to go straight to the issue again and again and again, uh, I find it also, uh, to, to me, uh, I feel it so is uh, very, uh, you really need a lot of energy <laughs> to do that. Yeah. But thank you for sharing about that. You see, we need to clear and, and sometimes uh, we don't think so much. But how do we going to apologize? Yeah, you say we clear there, but uh, for my, my way of to, to talk to them, we just tell them I apologize or we don't, we don't use the word that we apologize. But 
if if we are going to say uh, we are sorry lah, okay, for what certain thing that we have done, maybe we know what it is. How are we going to say properly to apologize and ask for forgiveness? What would be the good way, or is there any way that we feel that it's nice to say out? Um, okay, in one way, there's no one fits way lah. The main thing is to with the sincerity lah, from your heart lah. Huh? When you say sorry, and uh, we need not go into drama and uh, all that, uh, uh, it's, it's just sincerely from the heart, uh, like what I did uh, many years ago, just through the phone, I just say, I'm sorry for whatever wrong I may have done to you. I'm, I'm, I, I just say, I'm sorry. La. I didn't say, please forgive me, please forgive me. No, la. just say, I am sorry. Uh, uh, throughout the years you have been with me, uh, they may be uh, uh, whatever wrong that I have done, I'm sorry for that. Ah, just that only, uh, sincerely from your heart. Lah. Uh, if not, uh, it will be like a, a, a block in your heart, like what Esther was saying, if you keep on bothering, bothering, bothering you, <laughs> uh, then uh, that uh, will not help you to our cell also, C-E-L-L. <laughs> yeah so how how to approach it is is uh just uh since with sincerity and uh from the heart uh, when you say sorry and i, I think uh, before that auntie Bolly also first mentioned that uh, if if uh, we uh, don't forgive or to be forgiven uh it's we who suffer huh it's we who suffer because it's in us it's, uh, once you said it out wow you feel so relieved and you can see that the consequences are very good. The consequences are very good. Oh, uh, it clear the air and friendships uh, flourish again. Uh. Oh. Mm, to you, uh, Esther. Mm. <laughs> so really, uh, I really emphasize on clear understanding. No? So normally don't understand. That's why I got issue. So if I see someone that... It happened that uh, mm, it seems like avoiding me or something like not so right. Uh. Then I will say, hello, hello. Uh, sorry, sorry, may I ask you? Uh, you seems like uh, not so right. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say I'm not so right. I said you're not so right. <laughs> then, I said, well, uh, you seems like quite angry. right? Uh. Is it angry with me? Uh, I will ask her. Uh, then uh, uh then that one will start clearing out uh start open start open the conversation and then uh, conversation started uh. uh then only we are clear uh, of what uh, what actually mean because sometimes people show a black face then what happened now uh, why got black face one so ask why uh. <laughs> i mean asking why is good uh. asking why is good don't doubt uh. don't imagine uh. don't add our own meaning uh. uh that that is good uh. Never act lah, just uh, go straight and ask. I will say sorry first. Uh, sorry, sorry, I see that. Huh? You a big black face, eh? What happened? <laughs> Am I in the wrong or I do anything wrong? Sorry, yeah, because I don't know. <laughs> I will just say straight away. Lah. Yeah, Esther. No, like Jean and Esther. So sometimes we are talking about this. Sometimes even you say you don't know whether you have done anything wrong and you just ask for forgiveness. So... No, you don't know what's wrong. If you if you say that I, I may have offended you in some way, uh, I hope you forgive me. But uh, we we don't always ask for forgiveness if this is not our fault. And 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 what as I said, we don't keep thinking about this kind of thing. Yeah, it, it will really uh, suck our energy. So things are like that, you know. So are we able to forgive and to forget? Is this these two issues that that come together, or we can forgive? But we don't forget, or we can forget, oh, we, we don't forgive, or things like that. How does this two because these two words always come to forgive and forget? Does it really actually go together? <laughs> <laughs> not necessary, yeah. not, not necessary to go together. Yeah. You 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 uh for me, I mm. can forgive and I don't forget. Uh forget uh, it is uh it's it's not said to forget the uh not so good incident, you see. Uh, if we not necessary to forget what have happened, we can use that as an experience uh, in in life. Uh. If everything we forget, that means you got amnesia. That means like you know, uh, <laughs> cut that cut of your life away. You know, 
Ah, uh, so not uh, necessary to forget lah. Is this just a phrase? You know, the English uh, sometimes they have forgive and forget. Then sometimes they make into a poem, into a song lah. So, uh, forgive uh, without forgetting is also okay to me lah. Uh, because some memories uh, are for us to cherish and to learn also. Uh. Even not so good uh, memories, actually, when you think back, they are actually good memories. Uh, you can laugh over it. No? <laughs> when you remember, you laugh over it. No? So, so, it can be part of your, uh, your life story writing or things like that. So, not necessary to forget. Lah. To me, lah, uh, this is my opinion. Thank you, uh, Esther. <laughs> <laughs> oh, forgive and forget. Uh. Forgive, I find that forgive is to make things clear. Uh. It's to make things clear. That is forgive. And then to forget, uh, I, I mean, be natural. Uh, be natural. Be natural, that means, uh, it, it, I mean, it will for, it, it can for, I mean, I can remember, remember, I cannot remember, then that's it. Uh. <laughs> then be natural with the process. Uh, be natural with the process. And normally, uh, the... If can remember, normally yeah, will be a laughing, la laughing story. Ah, yeah. It's a very uh, laughing story. Yeah. <laughs> it will no longer anything sad because sad thing ah, we won't. I I won't remember lah. I won't remember because I will turn it around already. I mean, uh, get some. I make it clear, a clear understanding, and then I'll return round lah. From black, I'll return white. So my connection will be white one <laughs> Will be all laughing funny. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Esther. Yeah, things we can remember, we, we can't and then just forget it. Yeah, just something like that. For me, it's, um, yeah, <laughs> things for, for what, as you say, uh, sometimes we forget, forget then we, uh, if we forget many things, we become like, <laughs> what, uh, we become Amnesia. like, what is it called? So now, or whatever. And it's, yeah, uh, so that we forget. Amnesia. We cannot remember anymore. Yeah, I, I, I do that sometimes. Sometimes, uh, they just don't want to think over this kind of thing, line Because you think too much, also, uh, 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 if this thing issue is settled, means it's it's settled. So I, I'm not going to uh, paying too much energy or, or what to do. Think think over. We may laugh over certain thing which happened before, but uh, I just don't want to be engrossed into this issue too much. Uh. Because I, I I I find that sometimes also it will be uh keep thinking of it now. Uh, make me uh will be into that that issue again and again now. Uh. Okay, so uh, yeah, so today we talk about forgiveness, which is uh, uh, as what well, uh, I'm really thankful that the uh, this uh, legend you share about uh, you, you do take the initiative to to really call up and say uh, that means as you say before you go in, from this world that you want to clear the thing. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I mean to have that really clear clear uh, what mindset that you have uh, that you want to do this thing. And then also thank you to, to Esther was saying uh Esther always take things quite quite e easy in a sense. I mean you can remember <laughs> can you you let go I mean even you forgive people also with uh you can remember the issue you remember if you can't also you just let it go. So that means forgive and forget it also depends on what kind of issue. So before closing, yeah, Lijin, Lijin, just say a few words or whatever. Okay, so uh, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> uh, if it's time to forgive, just forgive, huh? Mm, then you will feel that uh, you will be so light, you know. Uh, a burden would have been taken off and would like to wish you all uh, prosperity, not only in money, in health, uh, in everything good and everything nice. Uh, yeah, Esther, to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wish all Happy New Year. That, like spring cleaning, every year we just clean, clean. Uh, and mentally also clean, so everything clean. Uh, <laughs> so there's nothing to forgive and forget. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a nice one. <laughs> Everybody have a beautiful Chinese New Year. Yeah. Hope you everybody good health and safe and healthy. Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Happy <laughs> and prosperity. What now? What now? Hang on. Hang on. What now? What now? Hang on. Hang on. What now? What now?